I'm here to talk to you about how I am protecting my skin this winter. My skin has changed most definitely. I'm being out and about in the cold and then coming into the central heating and finding that my skin's getting quite dry and quite flushed. So I've decided to treat myself to the Feed Your Face collection at Temple Spa because this is beautiful products in mind to really feed your face and give my skin that extra nourishment and hydration that I know it needs this season. So it starts off with a cleanser. This is the Be Gone Cleanser. Be Gone is from the Sensitive Skincare range. Yes, it's suitable for all skincare types, but especially sensitive skin. It's prebiotic, so it's got really lovely ingredients to help protect the microbiome of our face, that's the protective layer of our skin. It helps feed and nourish from the prebiotic side, but it's also got really lovely botanical ingredients, natural ingredients, for example, licorice, uh, which is anti-inflammatory. It's all geared to soothe and settle the frazzled nerves of sensitive skin, help calm things down whilst getting some hydration in there as well. So you want to cleanse your skin, and I need it to be clean, but I don't want anything too active at this moment in time. It needs to be soothing, nourishing, but it also needs to have an effective clean too. So that's the cleanser that I've gone for. The mask that comes with Feed Your Face is one of my favourites. Um, I say that about everything because they are all one of my favourites. This is a really nice one when I'm quick um, on the go. It's breakfast smoothie. This one is awesome. It has a flip cap lid. I keep mine in the shower. So when I'm in the shower, I've cleansed my face, I've rinsed it off. I just give myself a little bit of breakfast smoothie. Two ways that I use this. When I'm needing a quick on the go and I just want to get rid of that top layer of dead skin cells but I don't have much time, then I will use a little bit of the product in the shower as a quick 30 second to one minute scrub because it's got really lovely um, oats in here as a natural abrasive material. But they've also been soaked in fruit juices so it gives you a um, an acidic exfoliation as well, which is a little bit more gentle on your skin than the rubbing exfoliation that you get with the oats. So, if I have a little bit more time or I don't quite fancy doing a scrub exfoliation, I'll just use it as a mask. And this is when I'm out the shower and I apply it onto my skin and a bit of a thicker layer um, and I use it as a mask for 20 minutes and that's when all of the lovely botanical natural ingredients, the enzymes, uh, fruit juices, apple and pear for example, that sits on my skin. I don't need to do anything but it's just getting rid of that top layer of dead skin cells that I don't want there so that when I come to apply my eye serum and my facial oil, it can then go into my skin because I've got rid of everything that I don't want to be there. So that's my breakfast smoothie, that's my mask or that is my exfoliator, two ways you can use it. So dry skin, um, I'm really feeling it around my eyes at the moment. The skin around your eyes is 14 times thinner than the skin elsewhere on your face. So it's very delicate, it's very precious and I just think that the moisture is just whipped um, away from my eyes. So I'm using Windows of the Soul eye cream. Uh, it comes in this lovely collection. It's very gel-like, it's very lightweight. I don't want anything heavy around my eyes. My skin's thin around there, it can't take it. But because of the ingredients in Windows of the Soul, not only is it good for hydration, it's an anti-aging eye cream, uh, awesome for my fine lines to help plump up those areas, but because of the ingredients in it, uh, for example, um, Eye Bright, which is a flowering herb, um, it's really good for reducing dark circles and puffiness as well, so that is exactly what I need um, for this winter season. And then the last product that comes in the Fiji Face collection is actually a facial oil. Now you'll have seen on my Insta and my Facebook that I have been using facial oils. This one is called Light Relief. 
Uh, it comes in a really, really lovely dropper bottom. I just use probably this half a pipette on one side of my face and half a pipette on the other side of my face. It's really lightweight. Don't be put off by the fact that it is actually an oil because when it goes into my skin, it just sinks in. There's no greasiness. Um, I have a little bit of a T-zone area. I can get oilier on my forehead and on my nose but I use this everywhere and actually because I feed my face with a little bit of oil every now and again the oil producing cells on my face kind of say thank you you're giving me a little bit of oil so we don't need to over produce oil because I'm not stripping it away with really harsh cleansers or face masks for example. So this is light relief, it's actually uh, formed part of our Christmas gift uh, for the 2020 Christmas season but you guys loved it so much we can actually buy light relief on its own now uh, because the the feedback from it was absolutely outstanding and I really do enjoy using this. This is actually a CBD oil my Facebook posts um, give you, excuse me, <coughs> it's not COVID. Uh, my Facebook posts give you a little bit more information about light relief and a facial oil and what it is and why facial oils are really good in winter seasons to give you a little bit more hydration. So there we go, that's the Feed Your Face Collection cleanser, uh, mask exfoliator, eye cream and the light relief facial oil that can go directly onto your skin or it can even go over the top of a moisturizer all beautiful and really exactly what my skin needs